Hi, I'm Lisa with Lisa Snyder Integrative Healing, and today is Friday, December 11th, 1 1. Some ones there. And for those of you that joined me on the group sound healing circle yesterday, for the very first time, I saw and I heard Archangel Michael come through. And I haven't really done much work with Archangel Michael. Actually, this was the first time that I was aware of his presence. And when I did a little research, I found that ones come through with Archangel Michael, uh, just from the little bit that I researched. So um, anyway, I, lots of lots of numerology things with that as well. Okay, please pick a number from one through three. And today's deck is going to be the John Holland Psychic Tarot deck. John Holland. And if you picked card number one, your card today is spiritual strength. Spiritual strength. All right. Spiritual strength has the, oh, excuse me, the violet border, which as probably not going to come as a surprise. This is working with a spirit energy. Okay. Let's see what this card has to teach us today. So this card is coming forth to give encouragement and remind you that you have the inner strength to complete whatever you've been working on. This final spirit card represents courage, discipline, stability, and persistence. You may be tired or weary from the struggle, but now is not the time to give up or give in. Instead, tap into all of your inner reserves for that one final push to achieve the desired outcome. Also, this card has the number nine associated with it. And the number nine is about completion, endings, accomplishment, transition, understanding, and service. If you chose card number two, your card today is the base chakra. So you are working with the base chakra or also known as root chakra at the base of your spine. And this is associated with the number one. So that's why I mentioned the ones at the beginning here. All right. So if you are working with the root chakra, the base chakra today, the color that root chakra works with is red. The sound is L-A-M. I'm not sure if that's lamb or long. I'm going to have to look that up. Element is earth. The gland is adrenal. And the key words are I have. And yesterday when we worked with the sound healing circle, uh, adrenals, people were working with adrenals yesterday. Known as the base or root chakra, this energy center is situated at the base of the spine and is most closely related to all of your earthly issues, such as survival, the physical body, issues of money, sustenance, safety, and shelter. To balance the chakra, practicing yoga can be extremely beneficial. Dancing or light physical exercise will also help keep the energy flowing and harmonious. Honoring your body and taking care of it on the outside will bring you well-being on the inside. It works both ways. And the number one talks about beginnings, initiation, leadership, self, courage, and willpower. If you chose card number three today, your card today is suffering in silence. Suffering in silence. This has the indigo border. So this is working with the mental field. Suffering in silence. This is also the number nine. The number nine denotes completion. Are you finally ready to let go of those limiting negative beliefs? Or are you allowing the issues in your life to become bigger than they really are? Your mind has been doing quite a job on you lately, and even your dreams may be trying to get your attention. When you learn to let go of the worry, despair, and sense of hopelessness, a positive new way or path will be shown to you. This card follows Trapped in Fear, the number eight mental card. When your fears aren't confronted, your mental anguish will continue. This is a reminder to take action and trust that your soul and the power of spirit will grasp you firmly by the hand and guide you. But you must take the first step toward healing and let go of the mental distress. Don't suffer in silence. Reach out for the help that's available. And for those of you watching this recording that participate in the Sound Healing Circle, are you seeing some themes coming through with the readings as well as what came through yesterday? I believe you do. All right. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Please consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and make a note for getting the um, uh, notifications so you know when these messages come out. 
Thank you for following me and watching with me and I will chat with you on Monday. Thank you.